Welcome back to Sweets Life. I am Sweets. If you have not already, like, comment, and subscribe. At least like and comment and subscribe. So what am I talking about at least? Anyway, um, and turn on that notification bell so you get notified every time I upload. As I said in my previous video, I'm trying to post 25 videos for the month of December, if not more, but at least 25 for 25 days of December. 25 days of Christmas. So, you will be seeing my face every day for the next 25 days starting, well, this will probably go up on the 4th of December. I'm going to have another video go up. I have three other videos I need to edit before this one. So, by the time you catch this, I will already be in the 25 days of Christmas. But anyway, today we are here to unbox two Glow Attic box. One is my monthly Glow Attic box for the month of November, and then one is my, what is that box? One is my mystery box that I bought. So, Glow Attic does retail for, well, the one I have. This is the Glow Attic XL. This is the first month of them doing it. This is retail for $24.99. No. $34.99. I am so sorry. My mind is going blank. Retails for $34.99. It is the biggest box that they have. Um... But you're supposed to get real good name brand products in here. So, we are going to start off and see what's in here. So, the first thing that I see is two sets of eyelashes. These look like, well, it's not two sets. It's actually three pairs. So, a total of six sets. And I'm just getting into eyelashes, y'all. Like, I don't know if y'all can see it, but I have on some today. Um, my first time putting on eyelashes on my own. So... For the first time, I think I did really good, don't you? Anyway, these are from iBeauty, which is um, a sister company to Glow Attic. These are the Under the Sea collections. So they are the same set. The top ones, these ones right here, are called Bit, excuse, Beach Please. Sorry. This set right here is called Marmosa. And this set right here is called Shell Yeah. So these are the Under the Sea collection, and it's just two packs of them. So those will come in handy. I see myself wearing the Shell Yeah, um, because they're very natural looking, and I do prefer the natural eyelash look. Um, the next thing I see is by ColourPop. It's called Baby Gap Peach Press Powder Palette, and it just looks like this in the package, and then all the names on the back. I'm gonna open that up, and this is the actual package and if I can get this open is it going to open today? there we go so this is the colors and I'm going to go ahead and swatch some for y'all so I think I'm going to swatch perky and glaze it Half baked and then get even. Oh, that get even is pretty. Okay, so from top to bottom, that is get even. Then the next one under that is half bake. The one that you can barely see is glazed it. And the one all the way at the bottom is called perky. And it does come with a full length mirror, um, as you can see. Didn't want to blind you, but there you go. So, yeah, um, I mean, I'm not against it. I will try it out. I love this color up here. Like, it got gold shimmers in it. Oh, it's so pretty. Um, the next thing we have, this is just a little makeup brush cleaner. So, you just take your brush, you know, get soap on it, and just you know clean it on these little grids so that's always handy because I don't have one so I'm excited about that we also have jet super hydrating skincare this is an oil to foam jet cleaner and it says it gently dissolves makeups and impurities cactus fruit develops antioxidants to protect the skins from aging and allowing skin to restore vitality and appearance of useful looking skin 
It says you dispense two to three pumps onto your palm and gently massage on the face to remove makeup and impurities. Add lukewarm to create foam. Apply lather on the face in circular motion to clear and rinse off with water. So this is what that looks like. And it's just a little pump. Um, Sorry, I thought my camera had died. I'm going to do a little pump. Well, if anything comes out. Oh, there we go. So it's just the oil right there. And then you would just... And then you just add water to get it to become a foam. But that's what it looks like. So that's nice, I guess. Um... You know, I never have to worry about skincare again in life, as long as I'm with subscription boxes. Um, there's three more things in here. Yeah, the last thing I'm saving because it's the one thing I really wanted. These are Collagen Essence Mask Skin nor Neurizing Facial Essence Mask. So it's just a set of three. I have so many face masks, I don't even know how to do it myself. Y'all know that almost everybody seems to get face masks. Then we have some Eye Beauty... Um, eyelash curlers, not eyelash curlers, Lord, eyelash applicators, um, which will come in handy with the eyelashes, um, which I did use one of these today, not this one, but another one, um, I think this one, yeah, this one is a little bit wider, so I don't have to, like, force it open to get the grip on the eyelashes, so I'll let you know how that works out. And the last thing out of the box, which is what I was most excited about, which is what made me sign up for this box, um, because I really was thinking about canceling my glow attic as well. Um, I think I did end up canceling for this month. Um, I canceled, but I, well, for December, I canceled, but I'm in between like, mm, do I want it? Do I not? Do I want it or not? So I went ahead and canceled it. And then if I want it, I'll just go and get it later down the line. But this is the MAC Cosmetic and Aaliyah Collaboration Lipstick. And this is in the color Try Again. I'm going to have so many MAC lipsticks, it's not even funny. Um, but this is what the little bullet looks like. And then this is the color. And of course, you know I'm going to swatch it for you. And that is the color right there. A real nice brown nude color. Don't be surprised if it, that if I record tomorrow that this lip color is not on my lips, okay? Which I probably will record tomorrow. Especially since I'm trying to get 25 videos out in 25 days. So that is the end of that box. Next, we have our mystery box. And this is just this box right here. It's a pretty huge box. It's very heavy, actually. Alright, so... The first thing that we have, this looks like a makeup sponge. This is a ghost makeup sponge um, by Base Blue Cosmetics. Oh, isn't that cute? It's a little ghost. You can never have too many beauty sponges. I don't know if this gets bigger, but we'll test it out when I wear makeup again. I'm sure it does. So that's that. Next we have, this is Saliva, Cel I'm guessing. Makeup Remover Cleansing Towels with Aloe Vera. It's 30 sheets in here. Um, I don't know. I'll test them out, but this has been my go-to. The Walmart Equate um, Makeup Removing Towels. This has been my go-to forever, so I'll test them out, but I haven't found one that beats that yet. Plus, I just ordered the um, Makeup Eraser, so I may be getting away from Makeup wipes period uh this is the broadway ultra lip argan all organ oil lip gloss um i can get this from my beauty supply store for like 2.99 so because this box cost me 64.99 i forgot to mention that 64.99 is the biggest box yeah um yeah next we have Emily Alexandria Cosmetics. Um, this is their Pearl Drops. 
like that in a package. Oh, it is a pretty color though. And let's just see how they look. Gives me any glow. Gives me a lot of glow. A little bit too much glow. Maybe I just put too much. So, I don't know if you can see that, but it's right there. Um, let me see what you're supposed to do with this. It's a highlighter. Um, hold on, y'all. Let me just see something. I mean, I guess it's blendable. Like, you can blend it down. So, we shall see. And speaking about, let's test this stuff out. Let's test out these makeup removal wipes and see how good it does with getting this makeup off the back of my hand. Oh, they smell good. Um, I feel like I got the product off okay. They're moisturizing, so whatever. Next, we have the Beauty Creation Flawless Day Setting Spray for all skin types. It looks like this. And we'll go ahead and open that. And this is what the setting spray looks like. Let's see, are you supposed to shake this? Because I know it does not say. But it does say it's weightless. It's 18 hour wear. It's matte finish. can be used as a setting spray or refresher. Maximize crackling and melting oil control. Okay, so we're going to test this out, why don't we? Mm. It, yeah, I don't just, ooh. I guess because I'm so used to dealing with either the um, Fenty or the Tarte one. It's not such a big miss. That's a big miss. So, yeah. Next, we have Bioderma um, Symbido Light. I don't know what this is. It's a soothing cream. What is it supposed to do? A new step forward, the treatment of sensitive skin is instantly smooth feeling of overheating and tightness and thoroughly moisturized the epiderm formulated with rigorous selected active ingredients, fragrance free, a guarantees optimum tolerance. Its silky texture is quickly absorbed, leaving the skin soft and supple. It says apply once or twice a day over the face and the neck. After cleansing with the Sabido H2O Miracell Solution or the Cleansing Milk. Excellent makeup base. Okay. Um, so it looks like this in the tube. I don't know if you can catch that. And it comes with the little, of course, the little sticker on it. I don't smell anything. Hmm. Okay, it's it you see this? I haven't pushed it. It just keeps going over. See, I'm not I'm not pushing it. Okay. Um, it smells pretty clean like. Doesn't have really much of an odor. So I can appreciate that. Um it's just a clear little bomb. You can't even see where I put it at on the back of my hand. Um Okay. Next, we have a Grace and Stella Rose Spray. This is, it says, Miss Fortified Sprays on the face with eyes closed before or after makeup reply is needed throughout the day. So it's just another little setting or refreshing spray. Let's see how strong the rose smell is. Let's see. The rose smell is super strong. I don't mind that, but some people do. So if you do, that's not for you. Uh, next, we have a brush. This is Beauty by a Bird. Um, I don't know if it's a blending brush or a crease brush. I don't know. It just It's just a brush. Um, that's the brush. We'll do the bristle test. 
I don't have any bristles coming out, so pretty good brush. We'll add this to my brush collection. Next, we have the Urban Decay Perversion Blacker, Black, Bigger, Blacker, Badder, excuse me, Mascara. And it just looks like this in the box. And this is the mascara tube. And let me show you the wand. This is the wand. Um, I don't know if I've ever heard anything about this mascara. Um, but since we're here, might as well go ahead and throw some on. I mean, of course, I'm not going to see that big of a difference because I have one lashes. But you can never have on too much mascara, especially to blend your lashes into the falsies. So, hmm. okay. Next, we have the 24 hour brow setter by Benefits. So, this is the shaping and setting gel. It says. Brush onto brows where alone or to set brow products. My brows are not set. It just has my Fenty pencil in it. So, why not try it out? This is what the little tube looks like. And it's just a clear gel, but we're just going to go on ahead and pop that on the brows. Do y'all know how proud I am of myself right now to do this over, like, on the viewfinder? Y'all know how difficult that is? Hmm. Okay. It's supposed to help sit your brows for 24 hours. Well, I mean, who's wearing makeup for 24 hours, but whatever. Next, we have more sheet masks, y'all. Um, this is Vitamin A Two-Step Sheet Mask. So this one comes with a toner, which is right here at the top that you put on first, and then the mat, the sheet mask is in here. Um, I've tried these before. I believe I got them out of a glow attic box. But yeah. Um, next we have the well, next and last, um, which I'm kind of type A upset about, but that's neither here nor there. Um, this is the Antoinette 69. Um. It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12 shadows. And if I can get it out the carton. So this is the carton sleeve right here. It shows shadows on the back. And then this is the palette itself. And we're going to open that on up. It has a gorgeous mirror in it though. It definitely does. Okay, anyway. Um... These are the shadows. You can already know messing with me. Which surprisingly I do have a glitter top base over top of my shadow. Out of my Juvia um, box that I unboxed for my Ulta haul. If you've watched that. If not, I'll go ahead and put that up here or over here or wherever. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and swatch some of these. So I'm going to swatch the color 6. Ooh, that's a pretty color. Um, Leo. My mom was a Leo, so I had to swatch that. Um, Muffin. I call my goddaughter Muffin, so have to swatch that. Oh, it's very creamy. And Alien Girl, because I like the name. And I will swatch one of these. Um, I'll do 420 just because of what the date stands for all right so top to bottom no bottom to top let's do bottom to top six is the one right here then we have leo right above it we have muffin above that and then Alien Girl above that. And then right here is the Glitter Top Base 420. The shadows are pretty, I will say that. So 
I'm not mad about that. Um, I was just expecting more out of a box that I spent $64 for. Um, I haven't looked up the products to know what the prices and stuff are. Um, but I will do that when I edit it and I will drop that in the description box below or I'll put it somewhere on the screen. Um, yeah, I was just expecting, I was expecting a better, a better box to be quite honest. Um, I like the products. I will get used out of most of the products. Um, but yeah, I don't, I was just expecting a better box. But that is all for that box and for Glow Addicts. So I think I'm done recording for today. I'm going to go find me something to eat. And then I'll be back tomorrow. Like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And turn on that notification bell. And yeah, I will be back with you guys later. Period!